Religious leaders in the country advocating peace-building relationship amongst political and religious groups across the country. They said this at a plenary uh, at a party, but together by global put together by Global Peace Foundation to brainstorm on ways to deal with insecurity in the country. Plus TV Manuel Hijene completes the report. For over 15 years now, the country has experienced insecurity in almost all the six geopolitical zones, including the federal capital territory, Abuja. The northeast, northwest and the southeast are the worst heat, as they have recorded unprecedented wanton killings and destruction of lives and properties. But the Global Peace Foundation is pushing for a lasting solution, and it's doing so through a parley with religious leaders. The need for leaders, citizens of Nigeria who care about sustainable peace, unity, true growth built around the truth of human security, freedom, the truth of nat national security to come together to reflect not just as an intellectual exercise but to work out sustainable solutions. Increase an understanding of the root causes of conflict and violence affecting us as a people. Two, Increase positive relationship between the Nigerian government and various agitating groups across the country. And three, encourage a refocus on the importance of universal principles and shared values as the glue for social cohesion and sustainable peace. As the 2023 Nigerian elections approach, youth participation in conflict prevention and peace building should be on the front burner because extremists and decent groups often look to raise fresh recruits among young people. Some also called on other religious leaders to use their influence in building peaceful coexistence amongst the citizenry. Nigerians by their nature and their space are very religious people. Every Muslim, every Christian is proud to be what he is and what he believes. And not only that, is willing to protect that belief with all that he has, his life, his belongings, and everything he, he owns. Therefore, unless and until religious leaders are involved directly into the, uh, uh, into the peaceful coexistence of Nigerians, there will be no peace. According to the organizers, the advocacy will be taken throughout the length and breadth of the country until a lasting peace is achieved in Nigeria. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.